Hello everybody and welcome to this video. This is a video where if you are a content creator, I hope you um, are watching and listening. Basically, what I want to get at is um, I recorded this video already and I feel like I immediately lost the plot. And that is definitely not what I'm trying to do here. But... I'm going to give an example of a situation and then what I saw afterwards. And this is not the first time this I've seen this happen. I've seen this on multiple channels over the years doing this multiple times. First thing was, was somebody did a video, okay? And in the video, they were basically wondering if a certain someone should be canceled because of something that they felt was an injustice, okay? Now, this person gave a bunch of reasons why this should happen, <clears throat> and then speculated using very um, triggering buzzwords as to why the person would have done what the person did in the first place. At the end of the video, they said, you know what? I don't even know what I'm going to do. Like, does this mean I'm not going to, like, follow this person anymore? I don't know. Okay, so that was the video. <clears throat> that was extremely paraphrased. In the comments underneath, there was, like, 60-plus comments. And all these people in the comments are, like... Oh, I didn't know that about that person. Oh, thank you for letting me know that. I'm not going to support that person at all anymore. And then the next person's like, oh my gosh, I was about to um, give blankety blank blank for this person and now I'm not going to do it. And um, there were just all of these things where people, even though the person who made the video kind of did it in a stream of consciousness, like just airing their feelings and not knowing what to do it caused all these people in the comments to make a decision based off the ideas that were brought up by the person who made the video so whether or not this person who made the video wanted to cancel the person they were talking about the people in the comments have already decided okay now the problem with this is is that this is how misinformation gets put out there. Now, some of you might be going, but does the guy need to be canceled? Like, isn't that, like, important? If, like, the person's bad, doesn't he need to be canceled? That's besides the point right now. The point I'm trying to make is as content creators with subscribers who watch our videos and um, decide things based on what we say... We kind of have a, um, I guess, a duty, if you will, to make sure the things you're saying or the things you are putting out there has, like, some fact and at least enough fact that you stand by the things that you say because you're about to influence a bunch of people to do something, whether you meant to or not. And um, this is not... A political thing this is not a right versus left thing because both sides do it both sides do this all the time and it goes so far from little YouTube channels to fucking news corporations okay this is how misinformation spreads this is how people decide things based off of what others say so all I'm doing is um, with this is I'm trying to implore you um, creators to make sure that the things you're saying and the ideas you're putting out there are a solid b based in fact and c like that you are willing to die by those statements because like ruining somebody off of a eh, i don't know maybe like that's pretty fucked okay the other thing is, is if you are a viewer of YouTube videos, and especially my channel, for instance, I hope to God that you 
if ever I make a statement of any kind, <clears throat> that you fact check it, that you look and see, um, like, if I'm talking shit or not. And even if it's something you agree with, I hope that you go and research that thing. So you know for yourself, like, we all have independent minds to be able to fucking research shit. So let's do that. Let's not just fucking swallow everything anyone says. Um, now, as far as just like cancel culture goes, um, I'm not a fan of canceling anybody. Like, I understand, um, like, hate speech is not protected by the First Amendment and all that other stuff. Um, so, with that being said, like, pretty much anything else anyone says, even if we disagree with them, like, they have a right to say whatever they want, you know? And that's fine. But people who, like, you don't like also have the right to say whatever they want, as long as it falls under certain parameters. Okay? And we all know this. This isn't, like, I'm not, like, breaking news here or anything like that. But um, just as content creators, let's be a little aware of the actions that can follow when we do a video like that or something like that, if you know what I'm saying. And as viewers of YouTube, just don't just take somebody's word for something. Like, research it and use your own mind and try to figure out um, what you think is good and bad and the ugly and the whole thing. So anyway, um, I hope this was interesting. If you would like to talk about this some more, leave the comments down below. I would love to chat it up with you guys. But until next time, I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.